What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome back, my subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Bergs, and you enjoy my content, if you can ring, uh, you can smash the sub button if you want to be notified for future readings. Just saying, just saying, saying. Um, this is um, a weekly reading for Sign of Virgo. I apologize, it's late or uh, five days late, but I was arrested on October 20th, or anybody doesn't know, and. Um, it turned into this huge mess. I was arrested because they wanted to take my kids without authorization or consent. They said that one, both kids wanted to hurt themselves and both didn't, um, basically, uh, was what it boils down to. And, um, I mean, my daughter did end up getting treatment. She's still in treatment right now, but my son never received treatment. Um, just saying. And it was just this huge hot mess. It was terrible. Um, I got arrested for disturbing the peace on my own property. Um, because I was standing up to the fact that the officer said I could refuse the medical services, the HMG services, because I had the crisis number hotline, um, because they were claiming my children wanted to harm themselves. And, um, but yet my daughter was the only one that received services at the hospital. So I don't know. You tell me, does it, does it add up? It doesn't add up. It doesn't add up. But, um, my son is home safe now. My daughter's receiving treatment. I'm out now. So that's where we're at. I hope everybody is doing well. Um, but that's why I'm late and I apologize. Um, so here we go. I received, this is for sign of Virgo. This could resonate if you have Virgo in any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, and Ben Haver, Jupiter charts. Um, free general reading, so it's only uh, very important to only take the messages that resonate with you. The um, spirit message I received for you, Vir Virgo, was um, um, feeling left out is what I heard. Feeling left out. So you could be feeling left out or someone you're connected to could be feeling left out in some shape or fashion. You plug that in, however that resonates, if that resonates for you. The Hermit Upright, Knight of Cups Upright, the Tower Reverse. Gavin, I can't hear. A Virgo is really going within and self-reflecting. And thinking about what they should do about a water sign. A huge tower moment is coming for this water sign. And they know this. Some Virgos want to reach out to the person, this water sign, harm. Okay, so you plug it in, how that resonates, if that resonates for you. So there's a Virgo, I mean, I'm sorry, not a Virgo. There's a water sign that har harms somebody. Person, people, place, or situation. Uh, person, people, place, family, situation, or organization. They harm some, one person or several people or whoever. But you know they did. You know they harmed them. And it sounds like you want to reach out to this person or people that they harmed. But you're going in hermit mode. And you are still self-reflecting and thinking about whether you should reach out to the person they harmed or not. But you know a huge tower moment's coming for this water sign, basically. Um, it could be a masculine or femme water sign. They're coming off as a night energy. They could actually be a young person, an 18 to 25-year-old, or they could be like a mentally immature person, like a 45-year-old that acts like a 20-year-old, basically. Um, but you plug it in how it resonates, masculine or femme. But you know they've harmed one person or several people or whoever. Um, and you're thinking about reaching out to the person they harmed, basically. But you know a very heavy negative tower moment is coming for this water sign. You know you know it is. So tower, uh, tower reverse, a uh, very heavy tower moment, um, a very heavy life-altering event that you know is coming, but it's for this water sign. It's not for you. This is the energy of you thinking about, contemplating about reaching out to the person they harmed, basically. Because you're in hermit mode over here. Your energy, Virgo energy. So you plug it in how it resonates. For some, you can be dealing with Scorpio because it's Scorpion energy or not. If you are, they can have Scorpio in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Femme, Haver, Jupiter. You plug it in how it resonates. And for some Virgos, they want to reach out to a water sign and communicate apologies for sleeping with their partner. But they know it will call, cause chaos. Oh, whoa. Okay. And for some of you guys, I heard you want to reach out to a water sign. 
and uh, Cancer Pisces Scorpio masculine or femme and apologize for sleeping with their partner, I heard. But I know, but you know, it would cause a lot of chaos. You reaching out and apologizing for sleeping with their partner, basically. So I think they caught you sleeping with their partner, and that it would cause a tower moment that you knew it would, come, would that you knew would be coming because you know they know because I think they caught you. So you plug it in, however that resonates. If that resonates for you, spirit messages you have sign a Virgo. Four of Cups reversed, Two of Pentacles upright. Let me look up this Four of Cups reversed real quick. Ready for a fresh start, basically. Yeah. So ready for a fresh start. Energy. A particular Virgo is about to start dating again. Really about to put themselves out there. Online dating for some. Some bars okay so you plug it in how it resonates if that resonates with you um so this is uh i'm presuming a single virgo um if this resonates with you i heard um, you're going to start putting yourself back out there so out into the single dating world for some of you guys i heard it's going to be online dating for some it's going to be um bars so you're going to go to bars and probably you know single and ready to mingle energy um hopefully um you know use your person picker wisely uh, bars can, um, I met my ex-husband in a bar and I never wish I never married the man, just saying. Uh, but, you know, everybody's different. So just be careful, be careful, be careful. Um, so this is you, um, fresh start in dating, basically. I feel you're a single Virgo. If this resonates with you, for some it's going to be bars, for some it's going to be online dating, for some it's both. Um, and then Two of Pentacles Upright is juggling energy. So I think that's a juggling with the dating. You're going to have lots of options and you're not going to commit yourself down, tie yourself down to one person. You're really going to play the field and really going to um, um, play the field and be choosy, I'm feeling. So you're not going to tie yourself down. This is not tying yourself down because you'll be playing the field energy. Um, that's what I'm feeling on this. You plug it in, how it resonates, if that resonates with you. I think you know your worth. I think you know your worth. Just be careful and don't hurt anybody, you know, because um, what comes around goes around. So, you know, as long as you're upright and upfront and dating, you know, and they know what to expect when you first start communicating with them, then yeah, absolutely. Then as long as you're upright and you communicate, hey, I don't want to be tied down right now, then, then yeah, but just don't lie, you know, just don't lie. If, you know, helpful advice, anybody needs to hear that. Spirit messages you have, Santa Virgo. Four ones upright, death reverse. A Virgo is very regretful being hired as a hitman in the past. They realized they were messing with a very happy family. They are about to communicate this to a very important person soon. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. Well, this is a pretty good one, Virgo. This resonates with you. Um, whoever this is, you were hired to be a hitman to a family in the past. In some shape, form, or fashion. I heard hitman. So you're masculine energy or you have penal parts. Just saying. 
but you were hired to be a, a hitman to a family in the past, but I heard you realize they're a very happy family, very good, happy family, and you have serious regrets of basically um, being hired as their hitman. Heard you're about to communicate this with a very important person soon. And it's going to be uh, very, very, very changing to this situation. Really turn things around. Know this. Okay, I heard it's going to be very, very changing to this situation. Um, so you delivering this important information, I guess, on somebody hiring you to be a hitman to a family. Um, obviously, um, obviously, if they were hiring you to be a hitman for a family, it's obviously about money, obviously. Um, but but you're about to release this information because you're in severe regrets if this resonates with you. And I don't blame you. Um, I don't blame you. I don't blame you. Um, but I heard it's going to be life changing to this um, situation. So it's really going to help this family, I feel. So good kudos to you. So this is the happy family unit for Wands Upright. Happy family unit that you were basically hired to off either the parent or parents or all of them. And then, um, but it didn't happen. It didn't happen. And then death reversed. They're still here. They're still here. For some, you could be dealing with Scorpio because it's Scorpion energy or not. If you are, they could have Scorpio in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, North, and Venus, Jupiter. You plug it in how it resonates, if that resonates for you. Okay, wow. A particular Virgo is about to release some very important information on the Gemini masculine. For a court case. It's going to be very helpful. Okay, I heard a Okay, so if this resonates with you, Virgo, I heard you're going to release some information on a Gemini masculine um, regarding a court case. Um, some information for a court case, either for the Gemini masculine's court case or for somebody um, they're going up against in the court case. Uh, I heard it's going to be very helpful. You plug it in how it resonates. They could have Gemini masculine and Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Moon, Hebrew, Jupiter. You could be friends of this Gemini masculine or they could be somebody that negatively in your life um, that's harmed you or somebody you're connected to that you care about and you want to help um, the other party possibly you plug it in how it resonates we have peace number 28 could be very significant in your life in some shape form or fashion number 28 that could be an age of you or somebody you're connected to it could be a date of birth number a green card number social security number um, it could be a lottery number it could be a significant number reoccurring number you're seeing on advertisements or billboards number 28 peace A particular Virgo has peace now. It's not easy, but it is peaceful. Well, that's good if that resonates for you. Okay, I heard a particular Virgo has peace now. It's not easy, but it is peaceful. So you plug in your life how it resonates. So you have peace in some shape, form, or fashion. I heard it's not easy, so you probably struggle financially. If this resonates with you, but I heard it is peaceful. And let me tell you, whoever that's for, I struggle financially. I struggle freaking financially. But do I always provide everything my children need? Absolutely. Would I have it any other way? No. Because I made my own money. Always have made my own money. And I always have always supported my kids. And it feels good to support my kids and do it um, as a single woman. You know, so um, absolutely. It makes me feel very peaceful inside because, you know, I know how to manage money properly when I have it. I know how to manage it. Um, and so, uh, you know, even though I'm not rich, I have lots of peace. So I can relate to that type of energy is what I'm trying to say. So you go with your bad self. So peace energy. You don't you're not rich, but you are you have peace. And that's kind of the energy I, I feel so I can relate with that. So you plug it in how that resonates that resonates with you. And a particular Virgo is extremely regretful of the past. They're about to really, really, really turn things around for a fire sign feminine. Okay, and I heard a particular Virgo is very regretful of the past. They're about to turn things around in a positive way for a fire sign fem. 
So they want peace with this Firesign fam. They're very regretful of something that has happened in the past with the Firesign fam. An Aries Leo Sag feminine energy. And they're about to turn it around a positive way for this Aries Leo Sag feminine energy. So they want peace with this Aries Leo Sag fam. And they're about to basically pay it forward in um, some type of way. I think for some it's information. For some, it could be gifts. For some, it could be information. For some, it could be donation. For some, it could be physical gift. For some, it could be assistance. You plug it in how it resonates, but some kind of paying it forward energy to Aries, Leo, Sag, Fem energy um, because you were regretful of how something happened with the Aries, Leo, Sag, Fem energy in the past. So you plug it in how that resonates, if that resonates with you. Let me see if I hear anything else. Antoine, Antonio, Paul, Rico, Antoine, Antonio, Paul, Rico, Chris, Paula, Pearl, Chris, Paul, and Pearl. Marquita, Compton, Compton, Marquita and Compton, Teresa, Sally, Vanessa, Teresa, Sally, and Vanessa. So you plug it in your life, however that resonates. If that resonates with you, um, you plug it in. All right, you guys, we're done. I hope this helped. If you think anyone else could benefit from these messages, Debbie, Dakota, and Rich. Debbie, Dakota, and Rich as well. Debbie, Dakota, and Rich. So you plug those in how it resonates. If you think anyone else could benefit, that, now that could be, that could be your name, uh, first name, uh, your name, somebody else's name, first name, middle name, last name, nickname, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Um, you have to plug those names in however they resonate. They resonate for you. I'm um, just saying. All right, you guys, if you think anyone else could benefit from these messages, please share these videos on your social media. I'd very much appreciate it. Love you guys so much. Namaste.